Swearing and cuss words are pretty common in pop music these days. And if you're DJing in a club where everyone's an adult, well, no one really cares. But what if you're playing a kiddie birthday party? Or let's say you're DJing for your grandma's 90th birthday. Well, it can get a bit awkward, especially if your relatives tend to be a little bit more on the conservative side. And it can be pretty disastrous if you've got a bunch of eight-year-olds repeating dirty words because, well, you forgot to drop the clean version of a track. If you've had that problem before, I've got a quick tip for you in this video. DJ apps have a sensor feature that you can trigger using your computer's keyboard. This is handy because not all DJ controllers have a specific control for it. So whenever a dirty word comes up, you can press the sensor button on the computer keyboard and it does a slip reverse. Basically, it sounds like you're doing a rewind while the track continues to play. So let's check out how that sounds. Let's say I'm DJing for a fun family gathering over the holidays. Everyone's in a good mood and, well, everyone's getting turned. Oh yeah, and so I feel like playing one of my favorite party tracks of all time. I drop it in a deck and hit play, only to realize that, oh no, it's the explicit version of the tune and not the clean one. What I can do is that I can just hit the sensor button when the naughty words pop up, and in this particular track, there's a lot. Let's check it out. To you cowards, then it's gonna be quick. I oh, you made up in the jail before, so oh, boy, you know, let my catch you run with, get done with, jump quick. If I'm gonna poke the dog with some bump, with some up, they go to gun click. Now, one. So that's how it sounds. The keyboard shortcuts are different for each DJ software, so here's a cheat sheet for the most popular ones. For Serato DJ, the buttons are U and J on your keyboard. For Rekordbox DJ, it's S and J. For Virtual DJ 8, it's U and J. But you need to load the Factory Optimal Keyboard preset over in the Preferences. And for Tractor, you just have to enter Flux Mode and hit Reverse. You can do this in the Preferences. You can map this to a keyboard shortcut. Of course, the best thing to do would be to drop the clean version of the track, but the sensor button does help in a pinch. I hope you guys like this video. Hit the thumbs up and share this with other DJs who would find it useful. My name is Joey. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to see you next time.